So designers, if you don't know about this website, you are missing up a lot of things. So welcome back to my channel, The Tech Viper. And today in this video, I will not be talking about Figma or any other AI tools, but I will be talking about one of the tools which I found out very recently. And the name of this tool is Visily.ai. And it's wonderful. It's lovely. You can do everything like prototyping to wireframe, high fidelity, low fidelity designs, uh, different sorts of AI tools are they are already integrated in the tool. So it's a lovely website and today I will be showcasing you how to use it, what are the features of it, the pricing plans and everything. So before that I want you guys to please do subscribe my channel and click the bell icon so that you get notified with all the updates and such tools so that I can share you and you can boost your productivity. So without wasting time let's see what we can do with this website. So you can see now we came over to this website that is visily.ai and it's a great tool as I told you can use different AI stuffs, you can create designs using AI, you can use templates and much more. So let's explore it. So first of all let me log in. I'm logging in with my Gmail. So we came to this website. Let's go to teams and space. From here we need to start creating our templates. So here you can see there are create blank board, start with templates, start with AI, import styles and designs, duplicate boards, create folder. Even you can invite your members to collaborate. This is a great thing. Just everything like a Figma. Now here you can see you can start with low fidelity design, high fidelity design and diagrams. Let's start with a low fidelity design. That's the basic step. So we came to this part and here you can just create a low fidelity design like if I press F on my keyboard as I'm doing starting from the scratch I will select screen size here as mobile I got something like this and now suppose I want to have I can directly drag those things from here like I want an image section edit over here Decrease the size the way you want. Clicking over here. If I go over here, I can turn on the layout grid. Now simply select it, align it, and by holding option, you can just see the spacing. Then I want something like a button. I can just click over here, I can just put it over here. I got a button then uh, from templates I want a product card I will click over it I will drag and drop it over here see it's responsive by holding to option you can just do it like that and if I just go over here and just click over here now if I select the whole part, turn off the layout grid, you can just change the image like see it gave me a high fidelity design and auto, it doesn't end here if you want to create any design from sketch you can just click f on my keyboard put it over here select the screen size like iphone 14 and you can just start creating those like if you go to elements you will get rectangle line triangle oval container like if i press a on my keyboard drop something it's a container now change this color section all the tool section is over here you can change the layer opacity border styles corner radius drop a shadow you can even add tooltip like if I add something like this I got a tooltip over here like it's a great tool you can just select this whole part if I click over here I can just click over here and it will get converted to a Figma project and I can use the VZ plugin over Figma to import it that's a great thing and not only that if you come over here these are the smart components you are getting directly which you can use it at your on your designs also if I go to templates there are tons of templates 
these are just some of the components you are getting like if i click on screens there are different screens over there like if i want to add mobile screens like launch screens something like this just edit see i got it now suppose i need another screens like home page click over it edit i got the home page so how easy it is just you can imagine and if you want to prototype it also you can just click over here go to prototype you can drag and connect it with just like figma and if i just click over here quick preview you can see i got a prototype click on full prototype also turn on device see how lovely it is and then let's already part like much more prototyping and all you can just do it sorry i put it horizontal is vertical now see it's scrollable so it's a lovely tool you can also inspect it and get the code generated so it's a great tool and now here you can see you can just get the full app flow from here app flow web flow you can search it from here you get different flows over here diagrams you can just put on the diagrams directly from here and the best part is you can see tons of icons like if you want solid even to outline you get different sorts of icons here lots of icons if you click over here you can see 33k 10.7k just you don't need to worry about icons after using this tool that is the visili then here you can create the diagrams you can draw directly you can just change the theme from here like you want to change any color theme you can just do you change it from here text shadows radius what you want it takes care of all the theming part now let's uh, see another thing and also from here you can turn on the grid view and you can scroll to zoom many more features are there but the best part of this website the ai part so let's see first let's over here explore all there are different tons of part are there like generate design from screenshot generate design from text generate design from sketch generate design from diagram modify existing designs generate diagram from text modify existing diagram generate prototype from selection generate image from text that's lovely generate table from text modify existing tables fill data table generate theme switch between low fi and high fi as i showed you earlier run color assistant so tons of tons of things are there you can just use it like um if i want to generate any design from screenshot to how you can send it let's try with a simple like i want to create this one it takes a little bit of time by the way see i got the full design now let's just take another chat now let's explore generate design from text like mobile application i want single screen login page for dating application and let's see what it generates for me you can just write over here to modify anything let's edit to the board see i won't say it's great but somebody gave you gave you the rough idea what to and if you play with the prompts you might generate something great so if i go over here again explore all 
Gener generate design from sketch. Let's see this. Like try, I let me try with a sample. See, I have this scratch. Or let me generate with this one. And let's see what it generates for us. Simply, you are drawing something like a rough sketch, and you want to see how it's gonna look. That's a great tool, man. You can just modify it over here, writing something if you want to modify. If I add it to board now, see the sketch and what it gave me. That's lovely. Then generate design from diagram, modify existing design. So there are different sorts of tools which you can use and with those you can create your design. Like you want to drop a design tomorrow and you don't know how to figure out what to do, how to start with your design process and everything, how to start with your low fidelity, high fidelity designs. Like you can see it's a high fidelity design now. If I click over here, go over here, click OK, it's a low fidelity design now. So that's a great tool. You can just use it to create your, to put your creativity, just play with those elements, put your creativity and boom, the design is done for you. And now we come to the main part, that is the pricing plans. So if we go over here, so currently I'm using the pro version where I can do everything in startup, unlimited boards and elements I'm getting, private folders and boards I can create, 3000 AI credits per month I'm getting, per editor, 8000 template credits I'm getting, and 5 custom fonts, basic workspace library, 7 day version history, Figma export, with no watermark. So those are the things which I'm getting currently. But if you start with start it, or if you want to just to explore, if you want to explore it just, you can start with this plan, which is the starter plan, which we, where you will get two editable boards per workspace, limited elements per board, 200 AI credits, 150 templates credits. And for the business, it's a pro plan where you get more team credits, more credits and everything. So this is one of the best website or best tool I can say, and which is being, which will, which going to bring revolution to designing workspace. So as I told, it was a great tool. It can just boost your creativity a lot. It can save your time a lot, by the way. So I hope you like this video and you get all the things you need to know about this website, what it can do, what it can't, and all the latest stuffs. So if you like this video and if you love the type of content, and if you want me to come up with more such videos, please do subscribe my channel. As I told, I need you guys support. And till then, take care. I will see you in the next video.